I'm Fox 4 Charlotte County Community Correspondent Alex Orinchuk and the Charlotte County Sheriff's Office released body camera footage of an arrest made here at this Wawa in Port Charlotte after social media posts criticized the deputy's use of force. According to the Sheriff's Office, Wednesday afternoon, deputies responded to Wawa because workers reported that a man was sleeping outside. When deputies got there, they say they found 19-year-old Tedrick Page. This is body camera footage of what happened next. So, Wawa wants you moved along, man. Deputies say they've dealt with Page in the past, and they say he's usually cooperative. But Wednesday, he was acting strangely, so they called EMS for help. I'm going to have EMS come look at you, okay? The deputy pleaded with Page for three minutes before he got up and tried to walk inside the Wawa. That's when the deputy put him on the ground and arrested him. Page cut his mouth in the process, and as this video shows, a deputy used a baton to get control of one of his arms. Then Page spit blood on the deputy and a witness. I asked law enforcement expert and FGCU professor Dave Thomas about that part of the video. Take that baton and stick it between, you know, in, in between this, the upper part of the arm and lower part of the arm and leverage it out. That is painless, no injury, and it doesn't get much better. Hey. But a witness took their own video of what happened and posted it online, suggesting the deputies went too far. In response to the social media reaction, Sheriff Bill Permel released the body camera video online and said this. My deputies tried to help this individual and did not want to make an arrest, but we were given no choice because of his decisions. I stand by my deputies' actions, which were clearly within our policies. Thomas commended Permel's transparency. I think more agencies should do it. The transparency is wonderful and it shows people that you really have nothing to hide. Page now faces trespassing, resisting arrest without violence and battery of a police officer charges. In Port Charlotte, Alex Orinchuk, Fox 4.